Super duper cool. All the buildings look futuristic and there's a bunch of artsy stuff and it's very green and there's just a bunch of people walking. This building is so futuristic. It looks like the buildings from Robots, you know? The movie Robots. Bagels. They were made in Brooklyn, so they're extra good. We just left the hotel, Times Square. That's where it's located. We are going to the Statue of Liberty. Uh -huh. At the Staten Island Ferry, and over there is the Statue of Liberty. Birkenstocks. By the way, guys, this is a fake. This is not real. I didn't even know what Burberry was like three years ago when I bought it for like a dollar at a flea market. Now I know that it's a fake. Who cares? Oh, there's something in my shoe. So we're going to there and this way. Got tickets over there and then entered through there. Here we go! Ooh. Got these phone things to listen to. If you go today, you'll get a great... Very crowded. Well, I don't know if I'm talking loud enough. Here I am with her. A bunch of people from my school are surprisingly in New York City. I'm gonna try and meet up with a few of them. In the little back park, and then here's the little store, which has little handles like this. Look at this, Alex and Annie. I love Alex and Annie bracelets, clearly, because I'm wearing one right now. This is $98. Say bye to the Liberty, and we're going to New Jersey. We have made it to New Jersey. Woo! The city in the background, yay! In New Jersey now, we're at Atlanta United Gate versus New York Red Bulls. It's gonna be fun. Please, please don't talk about me when I'm gone. 
So yeah, so now we're just gonna go to the Red Bull Arena to go to an Atlanta United game because even though we're in New York, Atlanta United surprisingly is having a game here, which is pretty cool. And Atlanta United is ranked number one, New York Red Bull's number two. So it's like intense. And we got really good tickets. We're like right at the front row of the field. So it's gonna be super cool. So we're really excited for that. Polaroids I got about the Statue of Liberty. Just changed into my Atlanta United jersey. This it's like an abandoned thingy, my bobber. I don't know. We have made it to the Red Bull Arena. Everyone's dressed in Red Bull stuff. Kinda awkward, but who cares? Repping the team, it's gonna be number one. Gotta go in. Thank you. There are seats. This is awesome. There's all but the many night fans. Señoras y señores. Stadium and are now outside waiting for our lift. And then we're gonna go to the hotel. But yeah, but we lost the game three to zero. What? Oh, two to zero? I thought it was three to zero. It felt like three to zero. It felt like three to zero. <laughs> our coach, Tata, was not thinking very well. Started doing random weird subs. They didn't record much of the game. But I did get Julian Gressel's signature on the hat. This room is so cool. Giant mirror space. And yeah, I didn't bring any exercise clothes. I was informed not to by my mother. And they didn't bring any bathing suit for the pool either. So here I am in this room, unable to work out when I want to. Sitting in this little nook here with my Birkenstocks on, watching the city. There I am. Right now we're just in the hotel lobby, looking at M&M's world through the window. Where we're headed right here. There it is, two floors. Let's get some chocolate. Excited? <laughs> <laughs> what? <gasps> Wait, it's actually three floors. It's gonna be amazing. I did my makeup and I'm in my dress and jewelry for the dinner tonight. We out here, boys. Going to Eminem. We're at seven o'clock. It looks so nice. It's just rainbow in here. It's Eminem everywhere. Oh, it's crazy. Oh my god. The store just smells like chocolate and candy. This is our hotel, Crown Plaza Hotel, right in Times Square. All my M&Ms here. Yum. Let me explain the different M&Ms I got in this bag. I got regular milk chocolate mini M&M, dark chocolate M&M, I got caramel filled M&M, pretzel M&M, oh mint chocolate chip crunch M&Ms. So good. I mean, I, I ate a lot of it too. <laughs> After dinner, we made it back to the hotel room. This is a demonstration of me being 16 and pregnant. So full from dinner. Baby, here's my grandchild. <laughs> so full from dinner. I can't even just suppress the fullness. It's how it's gotta be sometimes. We're getting breakfast down at the hotel cafe. We've made it to Central Park. We're right here and we're gonna walk all the way up to the Met. Get some bikes to ride down Central Park. We made it back to the hotel and we got ready. So we're going out to dinner now and I didn't record much at Columbia University because my camera battery is running out. So I'm not going to be able to do that much for the rest of the trip. It's a new day to 
today we're gonna go to New York University first thing, go to a meeting for that, and then we're gonna finally go to the Met today. And yeah, so here we are again in the Times Square, waking up at our hotel and headed to New York University. Getting some bagels for breakfast from Brooklyn Bagel Coffee Company. Got their rainbow bagel with pumpkin cream cheese and a matcha latte. This looks so good. And I got a nice view of out here. We just finished the NYU tour where we were not allowed to film, but I absolutely adore NYU so much. It's where I want to go. It's just, <laughs> it's everything. I love it. It's amazing. It's gotten pizza from a random pizza place on the street over there. And we're just eating it in Washington Square Park. And then we're going to go to the NYU bookstore and I'm going to buy some stuff. We just rode the subway and made it to Grand Central Station after shopping at the NYU bookstore. Grand Station. This is so cool. The balcony stick a little bit. So pretty. Look at the room. It's gorgeous. Here's Grand Central Station from the outside with the bridge right here. We are officially at the Met. Garden. It has an amazing view of Manhattan. So we made it back to the hotel and then we got ready because we've got Hamilton tonight on Broadway. We're in Times Square getting some food. I got some taro bubble tea, which my dad has right now. It's very pretty and I'm getting some dumplings from this place. And I'm good. The dumplings are very good. The next day, Hamilton was great. I met up with some friends, we went to Times Square. We hung out there, then we came back to my hotel. We just kind of hung out in my hotel room for a little bit. Our parents had drinks. This morning, we packed. We got our rental car here, and we're gonna drive up to Ithaca, New York to visit Cornell, and then we're gonna go up to Niagara Falls. Goodbye, Times Square. We have made it to Cornell. It's really nice. I didn't record anything from the beginning, but I'll start recording more stuff from it. But it's really pretty and big, but it's in the middle of nowhere. Like outside of Cornell, there's nothing. This is right outside the visitor center. We got this. We got sushi burrito. The stadium is open for access. So you can see them all practicing here. That's cool.